So this is a walk up a local hill of mine, and uh, this hill is called the Hill of Tilly Morgan, um, and it's a regular favourite of mine. Uh, this is the walk we do. We park in a lay-by uh, right here, and then we start uh, walking up this uh, track here, and once we get uh, high up, um, we have some wind turbines. The route prescribed on this uh, map here is uh, somewhat different. Um, we've got these three wind turbines here and uh, in the middle turbine there's a good track which goes uh, right up to here. So let's get let's get onto the track then. Okay so I'm now at the start of a local walk which is called the Hill of Tilly Morgan. It's about 350 meters high this uh, this hill. Uh, this this hill there is um, the uh, uh, it's called the Hill of uh, Foudland, and that's about 430 metres high. A um, bit difficult to get to by foot, simply because there's no parking available. Um, but uh, with this one, uh, there's a decent lay-by, and it's a nice short walk. So, first of all, we head up this, uh, this, this track here. And... Uh, at the top of the track, we uh, end up at a corner uh, next to uh, a farm, and then we uh, go off uh, go off the road. Okay, so we're at the uh, corner at the top of the road. Had a lot of local snow here uh, the last week. It was deep in drifts, and we end up going up this track here. We are now through the uh, track. Okay, so we're through the farm. Uh, near the top of the hill we've got uh, uh, a line of three wind turbines and we'll be uh, uh, going up to the one on the left most one uh, which is straight ahead and uh, then we'll be turning right. We have a view of the uh, of the Foudland Hill, a bit, uh, a bit, a bit of a nicer view there. I feel. If we go back here, so that's what we're walking up. You can see the full extent of the uh, track up to the edge of the forest. Uh, so then we walk through that forest, and. Uh, and we uh, are greeted with the wind turbines. Okay, so we've got um, some deep drifts and it looks like this is about as far as uh, where the uh, diggers and snow plows were able to get. Looks like it's uh, completely drifted beyond this point. So we'll just uh, step through here. It looks like somebody's had a go on a motorbike going through here. Um, it is a popular hill with uh, uh, off-road bikes. Okay, right, looks like we've got our work cut out for us here. Quite a deep uh, patch of ground. I'm actually quite happy this motorbike made it through. Uh, makes my walking a bit easier. Means I don't have to get wet feet, which is always a good thing. Okay, so we're at the edge of the forest. Um, this is uh, a substation here, and um, this is a, a field track, uh, forest track junction at the edge of the forest. Um, we're going up this way on the way up, and on the way down, we, uh, we come down this, this route here, which doesn't look particularly appealing, given that it's covered in snow. That's uh, quite a lot of deep snow drifting there. Let's go up this way and uh, we'll uh, take a look around. So if we go this way. Okay, so we're in the forest and we're coming up to the uh, first wind turbine. Okay, so now we've got the wind turbine dead ahead. Before we get to this wind turbine, uh, we turn right and we go this way.
up this track here, which is banked out with snow. Okay, so now we're on the main track. So, first turbine. Here are the second turbines. We walk along this track up to wind turbine number two, and then, and then we turn left and we uh, head up to the hill of Tilly Morgan. Okay, so here's wind turbine number two. So it's, uh, it's a long way up there. It's a long, long way. So we are now gonna go up this track here. So this, uh, this track gets you up to the heathland at the top of Hill of, Hill of Tilly Morgan. We carry on up this track. It will take about uh, five, ten minutes to get up here. And this is your view. It's uh, you're just above the height of the Nazelles here. Uh, no, just under the height of the Nazelles. Um, so what we do is um, that fence on the horizon. That's where we head off. And uh, there's a small uh, footpath just along here. It takes us uh, past this uh, little Christmas tree. And uh, then you've got to uh, cross a uh, barbed wire fence. So here we are. And you can just about see the, uh, the trick point that we're aiming for. I always cross right about here. Just caught my trousers there, not so good. Okay, so very nearly the, uh, at the top. And uh, we're just above the Nazelle height here. So it was a, a very fine start to the morning. Nice, uh, bright, uh, strong sunshine, but uh, the cloud is uh, rolling in from the south now. A nice big view opening up. If we look that way. We've got uh, Foutland Hill, or we'll just do a nice big uh, panorama from the top here. Right, here we are. Hill of Tilly Morgan. Okay, so that's Hill of Tilly Morgan. I don't know what wind farm that's called. I think it's probably uh, Foudland Wind Farm. Over here we've got Knock Hill, which is I think on the border between Aberdeenshire and Murray, pretty close. And we've got uh, Lowland Aberdeenshire over here. And then we've got our wind turbines. Okay, right, time to go back down. I thought it looked pretty dramatic with the uh, sun in the background like that. So I thought, why not? Why not indeed? Okay, so we're nearly back at the wind turbines, as you can see. And uh, normally I'm heading uh, straight on rather than going back to the, uh, the most westerly wind turbine. Um, the, uh, the snow drifts, as I saw, were pretty deep. Okay, so... I thought I'd cheat instead of trying to walk through the snowdrift, which is always a futile effort and rather unpleasant. Um, I thought I'd just simply cheat. So coming up to the uh, substation now. And okay, right. I managed to avoid most of the snowdrifts, but uh, just the last uh, bit um, was a bit uh, difficult to negotiate. Now we're back at the substation. 
that's the interesting bit of the walk done. Um, the uh, the main track down uh, to the farm is uh, quite scenic as well. Okay, so back at the bottom of the uh, track, just heading through the farm now, and then we're going to be uh, nearly back to the car.